Hello again world, this is uh, vloggy vlog number 9 coming down the works, so uh, in the, uh, the at the beach for the weekend for a friend's birthday and wouldn't you know it, I just came across some donuts. Dojo's donuts, I got their French toast donut. Yeah, I have the French toast donut. Well guys, like an idiot, I came to the beach and didn't get sunblock, so now I just need to be raped. $13.99 for some black. Ludicrous. Thank you, Sensations, for charging me $38 for a towel and sunscreen. Good morning! So obnoxious. I'm not going to go wrong with going local. We're getting the local's favorite two eggs, two pancakes, and I'm going to go with the sausage patties because patties always trump links. And this place is known for the pancakes. Gonna make me happy. Okay. You gone? Alright, so my favorite breakfast spot here in Virginia Beach, Mary's restaurant, known for their pancakes. Rich pancakes. I went with the turkey sausage links to try to cut out some of the fat from the day because I'm gonna be eating like a crazy man all weekend. And some huevos. So we're gonna down this and then head to La Playa. I'm gonna be La Playa on La Playa. It's Spanish for player on the playa. Right, so breakfast is over. It wasn't the same. Pancakes were different. Changed the recipe. I don't know. It wasn't bad, it just wasn't the same. Maybe I just haven't been back here in so long I forgot. On to the beach. So it's not a normal day at the beach unless you got a bunch of horses, right? I say nay. Get it. Alright, here we go. Time for din din. Bravo, 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 bravo. <laughs> no more wine, Chase. All right, so we got some rigatoni and some spicy diavolo sauce. Do you mind? Rigatoni. She's talking to me like she knows me. Bravo, bravo, bravo. to you. So it's uh, another day here, the weekend on the beach, and I'm uh, always the first one up, no matter where I am. So it means I just get a little, have a little solo dolo time, taking a little stroll on the beach. Got some agua, rehydrating from a little too much fun last night. But uh, yeah, well, I had to get off the beach because honestly, just too many people running. I can't tell I fitness that early in the morning. No, I'm saying. I think it's about time for this walk to end, and I just found a local coffee spot. I'm gonna go get some wake up juice. So it worked out well that I went to that local coffee spot, not the Starbucks down the street, because the person behind the counter was Russian. Anytime I meet anyone or hear anything in Russian, I always try to speak to them in practice. So it's always good to tone, hone your language skills. I'm going to see if you guys can help me out with something here. I'm at Virginia Beach and they have all these weird signs up on the uh, light post. See if you can help me out. What the hell does that mean? What kind of damn sign does that mean? I mean, come on. What in the hell? That was a joke, people. Clearly it means no potty mouth allowed. Chase is just being stupid. Making it funny. The bay. I'm waiting like over an hour for this brunch. It's better be the best damn brunch of my life. Mm. Chase hungry. Well, we decided brunch is taking way too long, so we're gonna go across the street and get some snacky poos at the donut shop. All right, so uh, we go out to brunch. Sunny brunch, you always have to get a mimosa, right? This is a small. Which one's my straw? Oh, yeah, yeah. This here was called the Power Bowl. It's a bunch of local like mixed greens that they saute up with a little bit of garlic and olive oil, some eggs, and some heat at it. But really, that's that's the winner. That's the winner. Well, all good things must come to an end. Isn't that right, babe? Yeah. <clears throat> no. <laughs> Beach trip's over. Heading back home. Yeah. 
Good morning, good morning, good morning, everybody. Well, depending on when you're watching this, it could be afternoon, it could be evening, it could be in the middle of the night, who knows, so good, whatever. But, Monday, back from the beach, back to work. They just put this new Starbucks right across the street from where I work, and soon a Chipotle is gonna open up, but I have the sneaky feeling that it's gonna open up right when I'm moving, so, well, got that to look forward to. Hey, Chipotle's open, great, okay, bye, see you never. Anyway, so I drink a lot of coffee. Well, I think I drink a lot of coffee. I have about two cups a day at most. Um, I like Starbucks and convenience factor. I like they have an app. I like that if I buy a certain amount of cups of coffee, I get a freebie. I'm all about deals. I'm a sucker for marketing. But they got this really good reduced fat turkey bacon egg sandwich that is uh, muy delicioso. Anyway, maybe I'll start doing some uh, more Russian stuff in here. So a lot of you guys know I do speak Russian. It was my job when I was in the army. I was a Russian linguist, and uh, I still try to use it as much as possible today. So any opportunity I get to speak Russian, I do it. Um, Got to keep that. I like to exercise the, uh, my brain too, you know? I like breaking a mental sweat. I read it in a book. All right, so I'm gonna bring you guys along my way to school. And in case any of you are watching this from outer space, this is what you would see if you are a satellite. Headed to the Key Bridge, like I said, I cross over into Georgetown area for American University. Key Bridge is, of course, short for Francis Scott Key. Who is he, people? This is a test of your Americanism. Who is he? I have to pee so bad. Officially crossing over to DC. Another reason I'm looking forward to moving up to DC is you see all these people out here getting their fitness on? There's always bikers, runners, walkers. Being around like-minded people, it's good for the soul. Now the direction I'm going is actually the complete wrong direction. Uh, I need to be going that way. But this traffic up here is so redonkulous that it makes most sense for me to go the opposite direction and then cut up and around to get to American University. Uh, this is M Street right in the heart of Georgetown and it is just knucking futs, people. All right, so day one of uh, semester, summer semester is over with and got out a little bit early. So I'm staying up in the area. Gonna go pick up some dank ass Persian food, some chicken, some rice, some beef. Nom, 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 nom. Here's a fun fact, Chase hates the rain. No, 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 I loathe the rain. It's so icky, yuck, yuck. All right, so you can't even make this up. One thing that is amazing about me, well, among other things, haha, is that I always get phenomenal parking. Everywhere I go, front wheel parking. Just started pouring down raining, I got front wheel parking at the restaurant, pulling up here to uh, Boo Thing's place, get front wheel parking. Thank you, Lord. Where's your spot at the table? No, you're, okay. Beep me. So this is the general area. Soon, well, where you'll be living. There's literally walking distance to everything. Although all you can see right now is, hey Chase, that's cool. You can walk to those trees. Just trust me, everything's here. And this is going to be one of my new offices. All kinds of toys up in here. Nice. Alrighty, peeps, so uh, heading back home to Richmond. Spent the last eh, 24 hours or so up in DC. I had my first day of class. Uh, honestly, I don't know if this class is gonna work out. I'm, it's just bad timing with my move, with my job. It's six weeks, you meet twice a week, and I'm able to break away at least for sure one, from work once a week, but twice is very hard with my schedule because I, it's not a typical nine to five. My day depends on my patient base. So if I have follow-ups, if I'm seeing patients, clients, whatever you want to call them, um, it's very hard to reschedule short notice like this. And if I would have known for sure I was going to take a, um, I think this person next to me is speeding up just so they can see what the hell is that dude doing? Is he talking to his phone? 
Oh my god, call the cops. So yeah, um, I'm gonna try to make this class work. I don't know because my job transition, my moving transition is just not quite on the same timeline as this class. And I don't like committing to things if I cannot fully commit to them, if that makes sense. I don't wanna say I can do something if I can't do it. Good guy Chase is always like, yeah man, I'll do it. I'll be your Doug. Of course, you don't say that to school. You're just like, yeah, here, take thousands of my dollars and let me go sit in class. School is stupid. Anyways, it's neither here nor there. So yeah, heading back to Richmond. Got work tomorrow morning and then I should be going back up for class again, but I don't think it's gonna happen. But uh, right now I'm just more focused on making my job transfer go as smooth as possible because I wanna be a good employee and I gotta move on my crap and yeah. Also, this weekend is Memorial Day weekend and a bunch of us are going to the beach. And so I'm trying to plan and prep for that. Still make time for my workouts. Still make time to get this up. Still make time to get this uploaded and done for the vloggy vlog. I think this is number nine, maybe number 10. I don't know. So if you're seeing this, odds are you might recognize, hey Chase, you're wearing the exact same thing <laughs> that you wore in uh, that video you put up the other day about uh, what did I call it? Change is good, moving sucks, yeah. That's because I filmed it while I was in the Matrix. Time travel. Back to the future! Yeah, pick any one of those answers, that's that's your answer. So, yeah. Also, if you're seeing this, I hope to have already put up my review on my very first subscription service, my very first uh, gentleman's quarterly. <laughs> my very first subscription service that I subscribe to. The Spreza box. It is a pretty cool little box that has different men's style fashion grooming things in them. It's all designed to open up your eyes to different styles, different brands, different designers, things like that. So uh, hopefully I'm not eating my words right now and didn't get that video made because this video should be going live on Saturday. Maybe Friday, depending on how my Wi-Fi is. But uh, so one way or the other, this is your weekend video. Enjoy it, people. Go check out my moving video. Go check out the Spreza Box review video. Uh, I think I'm gonna start doing a little bit more of that style in between these vlogs and deep thoughts with Chase Judy. And so just kind of give you a little more insight into my style, my the purchases, the things that I like, things I don't like. Because honestly, I think that's the most organic thing that came out from this channel. Most people are like, hey, Chase, what are you wearing? Hey, Chase, what about your haircut? Hey, Chase, is this good, is this bad? So. I'm just feeding off of you guys, so feel free to just continue to comment, leave questions, and honestly, I've got my own ideas, but you all give me a lot of other ideas, and so that's just the direction it's probably gonna keep going. I'm gonna keep giving you whatever you want. Keep it in PG, of course. Well, maybe PG-13. We'll see how first game I'm feeling. So yeah, that's gonna be a wrap. I'm getting ready to hop up on the highway here, getting out of the express lane, so I need to pay more attention on the road. Always watching. Always watching, Mazowski. Always watching. Name that movie. All right, so, toodles.